probably, yeah, around about 25 years, maybe a bit longer. Yeah. Uh, I was squash and racquetball Victoria, eight years, yeah. uh, almost to the day. We're currently working on a project under Big Health's Innovation Challenge. So what we're doing is a pop-up squash shop at a major shopping centre, which we're hoping to launch in the next couple of weeks. Um, assistant Manager at a recreation centre in Midland, in Perth. Um, look, I guess getting as much experience as possible. Um, you're not always going to land the best job first off, or probably even the job in an area that you really want to be in. But um, yeah, my advice would be to get as much experience in as many roles as possible. As long as you've got a role that's constantly challenging you, that's giving you some positives and some wins along the way, as well as being challenging. I don't know that there's any one particular uh, person that um, I would have classed as being an idol. There's certainly been a lot along the way. Well, one would obviously be Heather Mackay, uh, playing for 20 years and never losing a match. I mean, uh, that sort of record I don't think is ever going to be superseded by anyone. I don't know, I think just the, the different sorts of things you get on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, certainly the events part of sport's always exciting. Um, look, I guess from a point of view of working in a, a small sport, it would be good to see the, you know, the, the lower tier or the smaller sports get a little more, more profile. I don't want to see the situation where the, the strong get stronger and the weak get weaker. Um, I think it's good that they're looking at a, a quite a diverse range of activities. So, I mean, the, the recent one about the, um, I think the masterclass in terms of cooking is something different and it's uh, something in our sorts of positions that we probably wouldn't normally get to do. So I think having those sort of different things, something a bit out of the box is, is good. <laughs>